Hi there, my name's Daddy, and I play Boom Beach sometimes. I really just wanted to give you a little update on um, where I am with my, my base, the attacking strategy that I'm kind of playing with at the moment. It's basically all of these... Uh, where is it now? Yeah, it's, it's all all um, these little riflemen ch chappies. So we've got, I don't know, about 80, 80 odd, odd of those. They've changed the matchmaking system now, so I, I'm facing opponents that are much more... Uh, well, my level really, uh, or people that I can beat. So I've kind of shot up in the in the VP, the in the trophies up to 1475. So you know, I'm, and I'm starting to see people now that are sort of the same, similar sort of level as I am, level 34, 20s, 30, 29. I'm probably going to go up a little bit more. I was really, really lucky, and I got uh, this masterpiece, which is plus 32 troop damage. Which is, I was just checking with the guys, there's a 1.2% chance of receiving that. Of all the masterpieces, there's like a 1 in 40 chance of getting it. And it's the maximum level of troop damage that you can possibly get. So, ting, eat your heart out. Yeah, you'd probably, probably pay thousands to have that from me. Um, I've update, upgraded my rocket launcher now to level 3. I've got two of the boom cannons, level 4 and level 4. Yeah, um, now, so now the matchmaking's changed, it's much simpler. You're matched according to people at your same trophy level, or medal level. There's no hidden stuff going on anymore. And this is a change that happened last week. So, go and make hay while it shines. I'm just wondering if I can raid at all. I don't know if I've got anybody. Where's this person here? So that's Bill. Where's his... Where's his rocket launcher? Level 14, he's going to have a rocket launcher, he's got two of those. Yeah, there's his rocket launcher, okay. I mean, the, the, when you're attacking, the, the kind of, the best thing to do is, is take out the rocket launchers. Take out the rocket launchers, take out the boom cannon. This guy's level 13, so he's going to have a rocket launcher just there. Right, okay. So, we're going to take out the rocket launchers, we're going to take out the as many of these cannons as we can, because they're quite big cannons. It's funny because the, the, some of the bigger cannons are actually more powerful than the boom cannon. I'm going to put this on, yeah, I'll just put it a little bit further back so I might take out some of these buildings if I'm lucky. Okay, then one should do it. Good, okay. Now I'll take out the boom cannon. Okay, I'll just pop that in between the two. So, with a bit of luck, it'll take out both of the buildings and you get, because you get power every time you take out a building. So I've got 21 power left, if you like. I'm going to go in on the side there. It's just that, obviously, you know, it's, it's not, it's, <laughs> those bombs aren't good for my, my little chaps, but still. There we go, got to keep them healthy. Right, it's basically a wave of death. Now, I'm just going to take, take that up there. Just try to shock them, because I, I really don't want them to take me out as I go past. The, the trick is, I find, is it's best to take, take, it from a side, take it from the side rather than from the right in the center because if you if you attack from the center then it kind of sorry just taking it that thing there. if you take it from the center then what happens is yeah, we're going right in if you sorry if you <laughs> concentrating too much if you take it from the center they kind of truth split out side by side you know sideways and you know you're losing all the effective force that you've got the power that you've got so there you go, Sir Charles. Um, I think I probably lost about 20 or 30, possibly. Oh, 45. Oh, well. I've got loads of resources, though. Uh, yeah, so that's, that's basically it. I mean, I'm so fortunate with this. It's unbelievable. Uh, plus 32 troop damage. So the other thing is I've got the resource reward. I've got gunboat energy. I've got two power stone chalice, 27. That's a pretty good one as well. And uh, troop health. 
Yeah, I could do with a big gunboat energy. So, order of magnet, all the order of things to do, to upgrade. First of all, more than anything else, upgrade your vault. It's it's essential that you upgrade your vault because that saves your troop, that saves your um, golden, you know, whatever your resources. And then upgrade your defenses, I guess. Uh, upgrade your troops as well. Do I'm just go upgrade everything? Who cares? Thank you very much for watching. Boom on. Bye for now.